Hi guys, uh, welcome. Today's video, I wanted to answer a question that I got on my Instagram. I'm also gonna be doing a Q&A on Snapchat because I've been so obsessed with Snapchat. You guys don't even know if you follow me on Snapchat. <laughs> You see some really goofy stuff. It's like my silly side, which is the real side of me. <laughs> so from Instagram, today I have the question coming in from SRS1231J. She asked, how do you balance your marriage and career at the same time? I've had such a hard time in the past trying to balance building a career and also expanding my family. And it was difficult because I didn't have my priorities straight. I didn't know, honestly, which one stood uh, at the top. So I went ahead and I decided to commit myself to my degree. And I started to feel really unhappy at the same time because I started to feel a lot of pressure to please other people and to please brands and to please everybody in my life. I was forgetting about myself. And I was just really stressed out because at the same time, I was working, 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 doing stuff, taking on projects and trying to do everything within a limited amount of time and with a lot of, pro a lot of pressure on me to return projects in a quickly manner. So I, I realized that I was, I was angry a lot. I was upset all the time. Every little thing that anybody did around me, it bothered me. Um, I felt really unhappy and I thought I'm like why am I un unhappy if I'm getting to fulfill my my dream job and I started to see that I was neglecting my family more than I would want to and I started to see that I um, Jesse and Isaac started to get really really close and I started to to feel really guilty for that because my child is only gonna be, oh God, here I go again. <laughs> Take a deep breath. So I felt like, um, you know, I was missing out in major milestones of Isaac's life. I just took a, a moment to myself and I'm like, okay, you have to prioritize the most important things. You have to make time for the most important things in your life. What makes you happy? And I'm having this conversation with myself. What makes you happy? My family makes me happy. Spending time with my family makes me happy. <laughs> Reading and, and painting make me happy. What else makes you happy? Doing YouTube videos make me happy. Okay, then you have it, you have it in that order. Friends and family make you happy, so that's your priority. Expressing yourself in a creative way is your other priority, which comes along with my YouTube channel. And those things make me happy. And I started to um, schedule my life around my family time. So the things that, I, that are the most important, I look at my calendar, okay? And I'm like, for this week, what are the most important things in my, in, um, that are gonna make me happy this week? I always say family and then I put in time, you know what, at five or around the afternoon on Thursday, I'm gonna sit down and I'm gonna paint. I'm gonna sit down, I'm gonna play with makeup and not even record a video, just play with makeup. I'm just gonna sit down and watch my favorite show. So I'm actually scheduling time around my week to just do what I wanna do. And then if I can fit in a um, some work related stuff around that, then I'll do it. But now I'm doing the things that make me happy. And that's how I, I found that I've been able to balance my life now because now I, I get to do the things that I love and then also do the things that I, I do love, but I'm not replacing them with the one thing that I love, like my top number one thing that makes me happy. So my advice to you guys is to make sure that you are taking care of you. You really do have to put yourself a priority and I know it's not easy because all you wanna do is just be that one amazing person for everybody in your life. You want to stretch yourself out. You feel, and girls and women out there, we do not have to do everything to be worth it. Let me just tell you that. For such a long time, in my early 20s, I wish I would have known this like way sooner in life, I always felt like, like I had to be the one to do everything, to cook, to clean, to 
um, raise a family, to be a business person, to do every little thing, I felt like I had to do it. And you know what's so liberating is actually finding people that are going to help you grow. And it's okay to have someone, if you can afford it, to come clean your house once a week. It's okay to ask for help. And the people that love you are not going to judge you and they're not going to think that you're less of a woman because you're asking for help. So that's also my advice, okay? Getting help, prioritizing, and, um, and yeah, those have been some of my key elements to happiness lately. So wanted to share that with you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed um, this video. I know it's different, but I really got an amazing feedback from my last video, which is titled, I Have a New Life. And I felt so amazing with the comments that you guys wrote. Honestly, even if you need, you don't even have to watch my video. But if you wanna go to it, pause it, and just read the comments. They are so incredible, powerful, kind, and I feel like I have a new family. So yay! I'm so excited about that. So thank you guys so much. Honestly, you guys also gave me so many great recommendations as to what to start reading in the Bible. And last night, I finally started reading Mark. And um, I'm finding out more things and I'm also highlighting things that just really resonate with me from the Bible. And I can't wait to actually go get it blessed um, by a priest. So that's going to be on Sunday. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Um, and yeah, guys. So I'm also looking for a Bible study club and um, a new church. So that's been my thing. Oh yeah. Um, anyways, yeah guys, tell me what you think about it. If it's kind of weird, um, let me know if you do like this kind of video, like just giving advice or personal intake or whatever as a dedicated video because then I could do so many more for you guys. Make tutorials and all that, they're fun, but they take forever. That's when you only see like once in a while you'll see a beauty tutorials because they take forever. <sighs> but anyways, thank you guys. I love you. Have a blessed and beautiful day and I will see you guys in my next video. Deuces. I, I started really letting Jesus, God into my life and I feel like that void is completely filled.